Like, the first time I heard Stefan talk about his work, I, I kind of had to get to know him to get to know his work. And, yeah, I don't know, I find that with lots of art, as soon as I like, you get to know the person better, then, I don't know, the work makes more sense. And, the yeah, the work can be yeah, very different from the way I work. I would say to other students, and, or the conversation that happens at Makeda's in the mode, or at any art school, is a more important than the work. You spend way more time on campus just sitting around talking to people than ever working. Because on your, on your own, you won't get anywhere. You just get crazy at you think, am I doing the right thing? Am I doing the right thing? And then, but someone just comes, go, the right thing. And that's what you need. Mm. You just need reassurance. Sometimes I need five people to tell me I'm doing the right thing. <laughs> well, like, and sometimes five people tell me it's the right thing, and I still don't want to do it. But You need to be present. There's something inside it. It looks inviting or it's happy, but then something isn't right here. Like it's, you need to get stuff out. Mm. It's not the thing. Is it not that fun? I also got very tired after, I think after four years, four years of writing in this body of work, <laughs> blah, blah, I investigate the blah blah blah. Oh my blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I used to do that kind of well, you know, like I had like almost like a formula, but um, it just really it just gets boring and, and no one reads it anymore. Yeah, and, I, and I'm not, I, I, yeah, I've probably said it before, but I, I feel like I'm not very good with words, so that, that was a way of kind of bullet points on not cohesively it makes a bit of sense so that's what I try to do there is kind of like just a stream of consciousness and yeah kind of like probably like Stefan's work <laughs> just like go it's a very hard thing to try and do like it's actually quite hard but yeah, it's to... sometimes I cry <laughs> <laughs> sometimes Stefan and I cry together <laughs> when you were doing this it was so hard to put up and everything it's like yeah, but then you that feel was better. A process. And also, I'm very difficult. Like I, like I'm on the ladder and I'm shouting at them. Is it straight? <laughs> I hate you. Yeah, right. <laughs> and I never you know if you're serious. And I'm already, I'm also quite difficult. He's already upset yeah. all the time. I'm already upset all the time. Uh, yeah, but I think it works. There's a gap between where I studied theatre and now. So it's also very nice because I'm like I'm 26, so there's a big difference. Like I wouldn't have been able to make this work if I was if I was 22 or 20. It, there's a big difference in those four years because you've experienced things now. You no. think you're like sort of settled, like because if you're early 20s, like you're still in turmoil. Like oh, but am I? Oh, what am I gonna? It's and now like I feel this year things like in my like just things settled in my body. Like it's such a weird thing to say, but you just sort of accept yourself. And I think it's sort of like, and that, then you can make a nice work. Mm. You know, oh, I'm like this. Like, maybe I should fall on the floor and I'll make a video. Because it's maybe fun. <laughs> <laughs> and you're okay with that. You should be like, oh, I don't want to. People yeah. are going to laugh at People are think, going to think it's horrible. No, when I, when I, I think you're very comfortable in yourself. I'm very open about stuff like that. And I think it's good to be. Yeah. Also, if you're making art, you need to be un open and honest. No, yeah, and that's also why, like, when you get upset, you get upset in that moment, which is good. You taught me that. I think I'm just more, uh, like, the same the whole time. Just yeah, always I'm, upset. Yeah, I'm not, but I'm also upset. Obviously, you won't make work if you aren't upset or if aren't, something is bothering you. Because it is like, that's where you make work. If something isn't right. Or like you had a bad childhood or something. You <laughs> but you're working something out. Yeah. No, I think I think that's what I think art should be about situating yourself in the world. So no, that's because you need to make your work. Yeah. You can't make someone else's work and that's why I feel very like, confident about this world. And this is my you can't fake it. Yeah, but I think you can also immediately see if someone um, doesn't make work that is that's a bad work. experience. Yeah. You've already seen it. Yeah. You've already seen that work. I've already seen that movie.
Yeah, I remember that boring one we went to last year. Got the high kick. Yeah, it's a course. Guess that was horrible. Is that your studio you're rolling around? Yeah. In, in the Michaelis building. But I made like a lot of, <laughs> lot of, <laughs> of similar like physical theatre videos. Um, but it was fun. Do you find it hard to throw stuff away that you've made? No, I'm not. Obviously, I won't throw away these paintings, but I throw away a lot of stuff. And also, my room is filled with like failed paintings. And because I make a lot of work, and obviously, not everything works. So you make like work for a month that's terrible, and then your whole life falls apart, and you're depressed. And <laughs> 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 I feel like, like they need to take you two to the psychiatrist yeah. after this. Seems <laughs> like <laughs> dramatic. Just like what I feel is if I'm not making if I'm not making nice work or I'm not like it's not going well in the studio or I'm not progressing my whole life is like standing still. No, it's just then like I'm not happy and and everything. So you need to make it. Make the, and also but you go through those phases where you don't make good work and it's just like growth. Yeah. You're thinking or whatever, but those are horrible I think times. I think I've had a year like that. <laughs> <laughs> so you get long periods, yeah, and then you suddenly like... Yeah, just all of a sudden. Like mid-year, you asked me earlier if I like the work changed. Yeah, like mid-year, I was, I was average, like feeling average, everything was average. And I just worked like hard for like three months. I was very inspired for three yeah. months. And then just made lots of new work. Most of this work, I, like I was done like a month before. Yeah. Um, but yeah, also when you said earlier about throwing stuff away, and I also feel that's like to do with the medium. Like, I, I, that's why I said, like, I think like, oh, that's why I'm really enjoying photography because I'm constantly, everything's just so light and it's like... It doesn't weigh you down. Yeah, like, I don't think I'm good with experiment or like, I feel too bad to like make a concrete sculpture that's not going to work. My medium has definitely also changed the way I work. Uh, and like yeah, next year I definitely plan. Oh, I want to do more spontaneous type work. Also, I mean, I, I love intervention and I love um, yeah, also thinking outside of the space, like where how can art function outside of uh, well, uh, like a white cube. And so yeah, I also make little maquettes, I guess, but yeah. you can't really get the whereas you every time you make a painting you can get the real material that you're using and it, that painting might work whereas I'm making and I'm experimenting, I know this is just an experiment. Yeah. Whereas when you're painting you're not Yeah, but also you it can't could, you can't could sometimes it. Yeah, you know, then sometimes so, it, exactly sometimes it turns into a painting, sometimes it doesn't. And that's that's nice to surprise mm. us. No, I just like life. <laughs> so are you guys gonna get studios for next year? Or? Yes, yeah. Yeah. I I looking for space. Yeah, we want to get a studio mm. together, but I also work at home, like in my it's a healthy. small room. It's it, very like, small. <laughs> <laughs> Sad. <laughs> no, it shouldn't work. It's not that it's nice because you just make tea. You don't talk to anyone. Yeah, and you go crazy. Hooka chaka, hooka, hooka, hooka chaka.